you, Mattel, for paying me and helping me create this video. I'm so excited to be back at Toy School. Me too, and we get to see Mrs. Cray Cray. And I'm so glad Mrs. Cratchit is gone. She's the mean meanest. Miss Cray Cray, is that you? Miss Cray Cray isn't here. <gasps> I thought you weren't teaching anymore. I thought you hated toys. I do hate toys. That's why I'm not a teacher at toy school anymore. I'm the principal. <laughs> the principal! Oh, oh, oh. I'm so sorry I'm late class. Oh, I, I have everything under control. <laughs> teacher Cray Cray is here. Mrs. Cray Cray! Cray Cray! Oh, hello, Mrs. Cray Cray. I see you finally decided to show up for your class today. Oh, listen, I'm not late at all. I was here earlier, but I, I, I have something really fun planned for our class. It's a scavenger hunt. <laughs> so I had to go, you know, put all the scavenging things away. <laughs> but I'm definitely here on time, and we're so excited because Toy School is back. <laughs> I'm so excited to be back in Toy School and we have the best toys ever to get us started. Wow, what are these? They're the very first five best friends. Meet the Cave Club, a group of prehistoric friends that are way ahead of their time. With a mammoth world to explore, don't expect them to stay in their cave. Wow. They're determined to do everything, see everything, and discover everything first. Wow. Which means these BFFs are about to make history. And so are we, because we're gonna be learning all about them in today's Toy School lesson. And we're also gonna be learning about dinosaurs. How are we gonna make history? Well, they're the first to have a sleepover, a birthday party, and to make friends with dinosaurs. And we're the first Toy School to ever teach a class about them. Okay, so first, we're gonna go to the Cave Club's YouTube channel and we're gonna watch some videos all about them. But I don't want you just watching for fun because I know they're gonna be fun. It's also your lesson because you're gonna have a series of tests after you watch your lesson and whoever gets the highest grade in today's class, they get to pick which Cave Club member they get to take home. And as a special bonus, they also get a pet dinosaur. A pet dinosaur? Okay class, so we just finished watching the Cave Club videos. Now it's on to the first lesson and the first grade in the class. And it's all about Tyrosaurus. Now, Pay very close attention to this lesson about Tyrosaurus. Tyrosaurus is a sight to behold. She's a teenage T-Rex with a love for jewelry and adventures. When the other pets stay home, she's out and about. Wherever Raquel goes, she goes. And if she doesn't, she gets really, really bored. Stomping and snorting until she gets her way and generally getting into trouble. Whether it's trying to paint like Taggy and making a mess or attempting yoga like Hunch and not being able to, you know, tiny arms. <laughs> Keeping busy is definitely best for Tyrosaurus. At her best, she's gotten the cave clubbers out of some dangerous situations in a pinch. Okay, so here's a rundown of her physical traits. She's tall and turquoise with a great sense of fashion, an amazing head of purple curls. Tyrosaurus is strong enough to carry Raquel wherever she wants to go. Now, her special skills and abilities, schlepping things and people, long distance running, color coordinating. Her key accessories are her hair accessories, her lattes, and her bramble berries. Now, it's time to take your test. Okay, question one. Is Tyrosaurus a, 
a toddler, B, a teenager, C, a college kid, or D, none of the above? You have 10 seconds to write your answer to question number one. Time's up. Now on to question two. Which one of these is not one of Tyrosaurus's special skills? Schlepping things and people, color coordinating, fashion design, or long distance running? You have 10 seconds to answer. Okay, time's up. Pencils down. Time for our final question. Who is Tyrosaurus's best pal? Is it A, Tella, B, Fernessa, C, Raquel, or D, Emberly? You have 10 seconds. Time's up. Okay, that's it. Let's see what grade you each will get for this first round in toy school today. All right, hand them over. Thank you, thank you. Hmm. Okay, for number one, Naya has B, and B is correct. Number two, Naya has C. C is correct. For number three, she also has C. Now let's see what Ellie did. Hmm. 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 All right, girls, I have your grades for your first lesson in toy school today. Naya, you got an A plus. You got every answer correct. You know a lot about the cave club. Yes. Okay, Ellie, I have your grade as well. And unfortunately, Naya, she tied with you. You also got an A plus. You got every answer correct. Here you go. Yes, yes. Now it's time for your next test. I hope you paid very good attention to those cave club episodes on YouTube because now you're gonna have to match each Cave Club member with their accessories. All right, let's do rock, paper, scissors to see who goes first. Okay, get ready. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! It looks like Naya has scissors and Ellie has paper. Naya, you go first. All right, Naya, match up one of these pets with one of the Cave Club members. I think Tilly Pterodactyl belongs to Fornessa. Okay, Ellie, now it's your turn. I think Flip belongs to Emily. Feral. He's a saber-toothed tiger, and I think he belongs to Warlai. This is Hunch. He's a dire wolf. Hmm, I can't remember who belongs to Tello or Slate. I think Tella. And Taggy belongs to Slate. Ellie, you got all of yours correct. Naya, you also got it correct. This part of the accessory test, you got correct. But now is part two, and it's much harder. You have to match all of these accessories to the doll that I call out for you. Ellie, you're first up. You get Emberly.
I think this is correct, but I'm not sure. Naya, you have Raquel. I think this is correct. Ellie, you have Tella. Sleepover. Naya, you have Rorelai. Ellie, you have Slate. You did very well on this test, but you did get one thing wrong. You gave this clock accessory to the wrong girl. You put it with Emberly, but it belongs with Tella. Naya, you did really well too, but you also made one mistake. You gave this hair accessory and cup to Fernessa, and they belong to Raquel and Tyrosaurus. See? Now Tyrosaurus is truly color coordinating. The grade for this round, you both get a B plus. Oh man. Don't get disappointed. I know there were a lot of accessories and you got a little mixed up, but you got them mostly correct. Did you guys get them correct too? Well, now it's time for our final round and we are going on an adventure, just like the cave club. We're going a fantastical outdoor adventure. How do I look? Kind of bold, like the cave club. Whoa! Now, it's your turn to change. <gasps> you girls are going on a scavenger hunt for the Dino Baby Crystal Glow Series. Let's go. These are the Dino Baby Crystals. They're part of the Cave Club. And guess what? There's lots of surprises inside. You crack open an egg, and look, you have blind bags full of fun surprises. Now, you girls are gonna have to dig into our sand pit over here and dig up each one of our Dino Baby Crystal eggs. You each have to find three eggs. Whoever finds their correct number of eggs, you get an A plus on this round. On your mark, get set, go! Ladies, what's the number one rule at toy school? 
what yours is mine, sharing is divine. All right, so now let's go open those blind bags and the dino crystals. These dino baby crystals include collectible characters such as dinosaurs, a mammoth, sloth, saber-toothed tiger, and more. Glow-in-the-dark hair accessories can be swapped and shared across all the baby animals. You could get slime or moldable sand. Parents, the Cave Club toys are available at Walmart, Amazon, and Target. You can watch the Cave Club series at the YouTube Kids link in the description box. Thank you, Mattel, for paying me and helping me create this video.